If you have GoDaddy as your web host, you can install WordPress with their easy to use automatic installer. To use it, follow these steps. Go to GoDaddy.com and click the Login to My Account button in the upper left corner. Then enter your customer number and password. After logging in, click the My Account button in the same area. This will take you to your main account page, which has the various areas organized in a tab structure. Under your Account Products tab, click to expand the Web Hosting section and click the Launch button that's on the same line as the primary domain name for the hosting account you want to use. It's common to have multiple domain names under one hosting account. So if you don't see the domain name here that you want to use, don't worry, you will have the opportunity to select that specific domain name later on. Next, in your hosting control panel, find the WordPress icon in the popular apps area. You may have to click on the plus sign next to options and settings to get the contents to appear. Clicking the WordPress icon will pop up the WordPress installation area. This area is where you will set up the specifics of your installation. First, choose at which hosted domain name you want to install WordPress. If your chosen domain name is dedicated to your site, then you can just leave it at your domain and you don't need to put anything in the subdirectory box. But if you already have a website at your main domain name and you are adding your WordPress site, to a subdirectory of that domain, write the name of the subdirectory you want it installed into. This could be blog, journal, WordPress, really whatever you like. Most people who are installing in a subdirectory choose blog. Next, you get to set up your WordPress administrator account. This is important information that you'll certainly want to record. Follow GoDaddy's guidelines for picking a username and a password. For your own security, don't use admin as your username. All of this information can be changed later on, but the username takes a little more work, so choose one that you're happy with. Click OK. Immediately, you'll see a little pop-up in the upper right corner of your screen indicating that GoDaddy has begun your WordPress installation. It can take quite a while for the install to finish, so just be patient. When it's done, another pop-up will appear in the same place, letting you know. Your login page for WordPress is accessed by adding forward slash wp-admin to the end of your site URL. Now, all that's left is to go there, log in, and install Profoto.